I saw that, yeah. Guy, he's moved around a little bit. I think he's, uh, he's focusing on that central pier, just trying to get that magical shot, it looks like. And uh, you can just see the, uh, the beach, the piers, the tower, everything, all just sort of goes hand in hand um, in Blackpool. And welcome back to a brand new video. So the sun, it looks like it's peering through now. It's going to be a fantastic day. And uh, yeah, we're going to head towards Central Pier because there's something been going on in regards to the pier. So when we get to there, we're going to discuss what has been going on um, in regards to, uh, like I said, Central Pier. So uh, come and join me on this uh, bit of a news video, shall I say. So yeah, let's get right into it. We're just going to start the video off uh, quite quite far back to be fair today and the reason being is because the the sea and the sort of the beach and everything just looks really amazing this morning i thought i'd uh, show everybody that i mean how amazing does that say you see the blue skies and the, the white fluffy clouds and that looks incredible and you see all that the uh those like streams what the uh, the beach and the, the sea have combined together and it just looks really sort of picturesque so yeah i thought i'd bring it to everyone just start the video off a little early um rather than going straight into a, into the town area to discuss what is being going on with central pier so yeah well, we're gonna move forward and um, we'll go past the comedy carpet as normal and uh, yeah we'll get central pier and like i said we'll get right into the uh, to the story but I mean, how amazing at the moment does that look? That looks fantastic. Just look at that. Look at the, like I said, the white fluffy clouds, the, the sea line, the blue sky. Just so many amazing colours. So we're just driving near uh, the, uh, the North Pier. And you can see, uh, I don't know if you can see it, maybe you can. It's all halfway just underneath the north pier like some sort of tractor um out and about on the beach it looks like they're possibly doing some uh, repair work maybe or uh, a bit of maintenance on or around uh, the uh, the north pier and like i said it's a it's a fantastic day it's a really nice the tower there uh, obviously it's not lit up this morning um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's, it's so nice, so fresh. Just nice coming out for a, that bit of a, a morning walk. And I think even the older uh, seal is uh, getting out for a, a bit of fresh air. Looks like a, a bit of a baby one, that one. There he goes. And that's the, uh, the Metropole Hotel, everyone probably knows about that one now. And the work is still commenting. Looks like there's a couple of guys right at the very top. And uh, it looks like they're doing some work on the chimney. So if they're coming down or just repointing them or strengthening them. It looks like there's uh, a bit of work being carried out on the, uh, on the chimney. They don't fancy uh, them heights, but you just imagine the, uh, the view you'll get up there. Incredible. So you can see uh, that's the uh, the skip as goes the uh, beach patrol, but this this skip there's so much work being done on the on the north pier and the amount of uh, boards they've replaced uh, is uh, quite remarkable. So they're certainly uh, like I said, investing a lot of money um, in North Pier at present. And as we uh, whip the camera around uh, to the, uh, the left, you see he's like a ghost town this time in the morning. You know, there's nobody around, just the odd person uh, walking the dogs, which you're allowed to do now. Your uh, dog walking is allowed back on the beach. So you see many people walking the dogs and, uh, like I said, grabbing, grabbing that bit of fresh air, a bit of sea breeze. So if you watched yesterday's video, I did point out that one of the stars on the uh, Coyote Ugly Saloon was flickering away and he's only just gone up that sign but you can see maybe they watched the video who knows 
well you can see it looks like they're uh, replacing or repairing that faulty star so maybe we got a maybe we got a new follower on the channel who knows but yeah it looks like that one is uh, is getting replaced so this is just a, a view from the other side of north pier and you can see that it sounds like a, a tractor of some sort maybe and you can see they've got the uh, the lights going a couple of people just uh, having a bit of a chat looks like and uh, I'm not too sure what's going on. So it must be something to do with the, uh, the pier, I'd imagine. But yeah, that's uh, just near the, uh, the North Pier. And how quiet is the, uh, is the front today? It's, uh, it's very, very quiet. It's very, very early in the morning. Very early. So you can imagine it'll be, a, it'll be very quiet. It's a couple of, couple of dog walkers. Like I said, the... Uh, the dogs are allowed back on the beach, which is uh, which is great for the owners and the people, you know. And uh, yeah, so we're heading, like I said, towards the uh, the central pier for this uh, bit of a legal battle, which has been going on between the uh, owners of the pier and uh, and the council. So uh, yeah, when we get there, I'll explain a little bit more what's been going on and uh, what the outcome. Um, is of that one. So, yeah. so the council workers are doing a bit more, a bit more work. Looks like it's uh, something to do with the lights. You see the van, which is sort of parked up with the cones inside. And, uh, yeah, very, very quiet this morning. So yeah, we'll uh, we're gonna go forward a little bit. Like I said, head towards Central Pier, and uh, we'll get into the uh, the main part of the uh, of the video. So just stopping, just before Central Pier, I just got sort of in trouble. I thought I'd just bring you this. You see there, there's a gentleman there. You can see he's uh, digging away, possibly uh, in the hunt of some uh, some rare coins or a bit of gold, a bit of silver. Um, but it's fantastic. Uh, you know, so we're just watching and even taking part in metal detecting. It's a, it's a, it's a great how you get like this fantastic buzz uh, when it's all bleeps away. We did do it for a short period, but it's a great little hobby. And uh, like I said, you get that fantastic buzz when it goes off, just to unearthing something of uh, very rarity. So it's a, it's a great little hobby. And uh, just moving, moving on a little bit more, you see there's another gentleman down there. Oh, so he's got his tripod, so he's possibly trying to sort of capture something. And like I said, it's, uh, you get all sorts of people out uh, very early in the morning, which is, uh, which is great. All sorts of reasons they, uh, they do come out. So the, the gentleman there looks like he's, uh, he's doing a bit of research, looks like, on his phone. And uh, he's got a, a camera set up to capture some uh, glorious pictures and uh, create some fantastic memories. So, yeah, like I said, we're just approaching the, uh, the central pier. You can see the, the big one and you can see the beach patrol is already out, getting prepared for an, uh, another day ahead. So we just hit um, Central Pier, and it's all to do with this little sort of outside bar. Um, and it's, uh, what happened? Um, it was discovered in 2021 that I didn't have um, planning permission. And an application was submitted in 2021. It was actually refused um, by, uh, by the council. Um, and a decision upheld on appeal. So it was, a, it was quite a, a bit of a, a case been going on. Uh, and there's, there's an enforcement notice served by Blackpool Council, but it's uh, been withdrawn um, following another appeal, which obviously which was uh, considered uh, a two-day plan inquiry in front of an independent uh, inspector. So it's, uh, it's been going on for quite a while this time. And the, uh, the Blackpool Peers Company, um, which operated the bar, then applied for a certificate of lawfulness for the venue, which has now been agreed by the council. Um, so it's uh, like I said, it's, uh, it's had a bit of a, a run in this um, this one. Um, it's, I mean, what do you think in the comments? Uh, like I said, it's. Uh, I mean, it, it, the venue began as a pop-up bar in August 2017, so it's been here for sort of seven years. And like I said, it was a pop-up bar um, in connection with like events being held in a promenade. 
um, and then it's had sort of a further seating area and a decking area added in 2018 and then the the canopy in 2019 and the bar has uh, remained open throughout the whole legal battle um, but yeah I mean apparently the uh, the peer company said uh, you know it's essential um, revenue which goes towards maintaining um, the uh, the Victorian structure of the pier. So yeah, so it looks like um, this one is here to stay after uh, applications and uh, a bit of a legal battle going backwards and forwards. So yeah, let me know what you think. Like I said, it has certainly been added. You can see the uh, the seating area um, is there. And we did a video when it was a really bad storm and all this fencing was sort of blown down those beer barrels rolling around the uh, the promenade i'll pop a link in that video that was a bit of a bit of an interesting one that one there's a bit of wind but all these chairs and everything and it like it was uh, all over the place and the uh, the barrels rolling around and there's a bit of a help yourself sort of situation so yeah that's the uh, that's what's been going on um with the council and the uh, the owners of blackpool pier so uh, let me know what you think in the comments. So I think that'll be the uh, the end of the uh, the video for today. It's a bit of a, a short video, just to bring everybody up to date in regards to uh, what's been happening uh, with Central Pier and that uh, that little bar outside. Like I said, it's been there uh, 27 years, uh, seven years, and it's been sort of going back and forwards and all sorts. But yeah, it looks like uh, everything is now settled and. Uh, that adaptation of the pier is uh, is here to stay so uh, yeah it's a, it's a great little thing i think you know uh, people want to sit outside have a bit of fresh air and uh, just take the uh, the sun in so uh, so why not so yeah i hope you enjoyed the video um until next time take care of yourselves and uh, it's a bye from myself take care bye bye See uh, some repair work is uh, looks like it's being done. It's like they're using tie wraps on the older lamp posts, I say, or lights. And uh, yeah, I don't know what's been going on? So there's a lot of tie wraps and everything going on to that one. Just, uh, just opposite, or shall I say, behind the uh, the cabin, you can see the uh, the go kart track, and this once was completely flooded by the sea. It's, uh, it's, it's quite extraordinary. All of this was uh, covered in water uh, a few decades ago, but now it's a uh, it's uh, sort of like a, a little go kart track. I think it's a uh, I don't know, it's not private, possibly um, public can uh, hire them and have a bit of a go.